in the beginning of 20th century when huge ships went out on voyages for months it was seen that the sailor men and the workers working on the ship often fell ill but did this did not happen when they were at home these illnesses happened only when they were in the sea for a lot of months now these workers and sailor men they lived for months on salted meat and grains so the doctor on board he followed their diet for a few days and noticed that these sailor men or the workers did not incorporate any fruits or vegetables in their meal so he advised them to incorporate or to have more of fruits and vegetables in their diet and slowly with the change in the routine of their meal or in their eating habits they saw that these illnesses were getting cured now that it was proven that fruits and vegetables were curing various illnesses the doctors started uh, experimenting with these fruits and vegetables and finally they extracted a chemical which they called vitamins now why vitamins that is because vita in latin means life and amin comes from the name of a chemical that were present in these substances known as thiamine so these vitamins were present in abundance in all the fruits and vegetables and the doctors also noticed that different fruits and vegetables were curing different kinds of illnesses while few fruits and vegetables were curing mouth ulcers or swelling of the gums whereas few of them were curing skin diseases and problems like these since uh, the fruits and vegetables or the chemicals extracted from the fruits and vegetables were curing illnesses they were put under the category of vitamins and since they were uh, curing different kinds of diseases they were given different names such as vitamin b vitamin c and vitamin p now it was noticed that few sailor men who avoided fatty food like fish liver oil or cod liver oil suffered from a condition when they had problems in vision during the night time and this condition was known as night blindness but few sailor men who had fatty food like fish liver oil or cod liver oil did not suffer from this disease now these sailor men they were having fatty food like the fish oil and the cod liver oil and that is why they did not have uh, this condition of night blindness so the doctors started researching with different fatty food like uh, fish oil and cod liver oil and found out various chemicals from them like vitamin a vitamin d vitamin e and vitamin k now since these chemicals were curing various diseases they were placed under the category of vitamins and since these were obtained from various oils and fattening food they were termed as fat soluble vitamins now these chemicals were curing different kinds of diseases so they were given different names such as vitamin a d e and k now the vitamin that is responsible for preventing night blindness is vitamin a now since this sailor men he had fatty food uh, which contained the different fat soluble vitamins like vitamin a d e and k he did not suffer from night blindness 
because these vitamins the fat soluble vitamins they get retained in the body so since he had fatty food there was sufficient amount of vitamin a present in his body and so he did not have night blindness but this salmon had because he did not have oily food like fish liver oil or cod oil so he did not have vitamin a d e and k in sufficient amount in his system now what about these vitamins which were earlier discovered vitamin b vitamin c and vitamin p it was seen that these vitamins were not fat soluble unlike the fat soluble vitamins like a d e and k these vitamins were water soluble that is they were soluble or they dissolved in water but not fats so when these sailor men were having fruits and vegetables containing water soluble vitamins in less amount they were often suffering from various diseases like mouth ulcers and swelling of gums which are generally cured by such vitamins vitamin c which is a water soluble vitamin is responsible for curing these diseases now because these are water soluble vitamins they get easily washed off from the body through sweat and urine so to prevent these diseases from occurring a person needs to take food rich in water soluble vitamins in greater amount now such problems were not seen for fat soluble vitamins like vitamin a d e and k because they get easily stored in the body and they cure various kinds of diseases